When you were introduced in December of 2014, someone asked you if you were comfortable with the perception of being the quote savior of Michigan football. I don't know if you remember that or not, yeah, but I, I was curious, how would you assess the job you've done six years later? Well, as I said, uh, at the time, I don't, uh, part of a team, uh, didn't consider myself to be a savior then or now. Um, part of a team, I think, um, uh, uh, been, uh, I mean, I'm not going to go back over the last five and a half odd years, but uh, you know, uh, love coaching this team. Um, current team and the past teams we've had. And uh, I think, uh, you know, we, before John, obviously coming off the tough loss, uh, it was a gut wrenching loss on Saturday. And um, uh, you, can't, you can't dwell on it. Um, just like uh, anytime we've had a win here, uh, you know, we, we got to move on quickly to the, to the next game. You know, same, uh, same with, uh, with a loss, you know. Um, you win a game, you uh, come back you know, Monday and try to do the same, you know, try to do it again. You lose a game, you, you try to make, come back and work hard and make, make darn sure it doesn't happen again. So uh, same, same mindset, same approach. Uh, you know, we, uh, what happened, what happened on Saturday, uh, you know, to your question, uh, anything that's happened in the past, it's, um, you know, that, that, that window's now closed. There is nothing you can go back and do about what happened on Saturday. Um, Next Saturday is still days away. So the control over you, you have some control over that and that's what you do today. So uh, back at, back at the, um, you know, the work of making sure that doesn't happen again, we have a better, better result the next time we play. Do you think about the NCAA declaring tomorrow an off day, especially given that many of your players may have already voted or from out of state and, and using absentee ballots. And then the second part is how you'll rearrange things this week, if at all, uh, to make up for the lost day. We've known about that for, for quite some time. And uh, so we have rearranged. We'll do most of our Tuesday work today. So um, what we had, what we normally do on a Tuesday, we'll do today on Monday and then pick up on a Wednesday, um, you know, as normal. Obviously, Don Brown has had a lot of success, success over the years coaching a specific style and a lot of one-on-one -on -one coverage. When teams start attacking it like it certainly looked like Michigan State did, do, do you reassess, do you adjust, in, or do you suggest that Don Brown adjust a little bit? Where do you stand on that when teams go after it? Uh, yeah, I mean, we have, to, we, have to, we have to put ourselves in the best possible position and, and, uh, and yeah. Always, always, uh, always willing and uh, and ready to to adjust when necessary. Jim, uh, <clears throat> offensively, when you guys had the ball, you mentioned it earlier you had the 28 first downs, were able to move the ball some in, in some areas and get some chunks in others. But I'm curious, when you went back and looked, was there anything Michigan State did in its front seven that particularly gave you problems? Because it, it felt like there were some times where they were able to clog it up a little bit. <clears throat> yeah, I mean, there was uh, – I thought our players, uh, you know, really, really did a good job understanding the, the game plan, and uh, you know, the, there wasn't a lot of mental mistakes really. Um, on uh, I mean, you're talking about the offensive side of the ball, there wasn't, um, but there were a few, and uh, you know, those, those uh, led to some tackles for losses early, and uh, you know, some of those second and longs that that we uh, talked about earlier. But um, yeah, I think you know Michigan State did a really good job tackling. Um, you know that um, in the perimeter they did a did a very good job. You know some of those those catches uh, you know weren't getting out. Uh, your assessment of the offensive line play, and do you expect the, the same five on Saturday? I don't know. Um, don't know that yet, Angelique.